Welcome to Let's Play Forza Motorsport 3 part of fucking 75. I realized what, like, menu I was on there, and I'm just like, wait a minute, that's not correct. Oh, uh, fuck. Good intro. Whatever. Anyways, this is the car I'm using, my, uh, Sayat thing. It, it's a Sayat. Okay, boys. I'm alright today. But yeah, we're gonna take that to our next race. And our first of the week. Because, hey, recording session stream thing. We're doing the Sayat Club. If that wasn't obvious. Limited to Sayats, of course. There's four of them in the game. So, here you go. We've got an Ibiza, two Leons, and then a Leon Super Cup. Which is what me, Rossi Miller, are going to be driving. So, yeah. Four races. Let's get right to it with our first race. That is going to take place at Ladera, the reverse course, for five laps. Oh, hey, Q is hosting me. What a dong head. You dong head. Uh. Anyway, he's. So, to Ladera we go for our first race of the uh, stream of this wonderful Monday. No, no. Cheeky breaky. Oh, hey, WTF. Hello, everybody. Alright. Hey, it's loaded up. We can fucking go now. After we look at the starting grid. Hey, I'm starting third. What a shock. Alright, well. Time for the Rossi Miller uh, Burton Show. Oh, hey, Ludo. Big dicks, I agree. The Super Cup Show, basically. I should have painted mine a different color just to have it stand out, but nah. Oh, well. Off we go. Oh, Rossi did. What a bitch. He actually painted his a different color. And before this is like available in yellow or red from the factory. I don't know. Oh boy, you started FGTK boys. Have fun uh, dominating. Because as great as like the GT4 FGT series is as far as structure race length and shit. Um, the AI suck. <laughs> they they really, really suck. That's kind of what drags it down. It used to be my favorite thing, like single thing in GT series, till I got to that point in the LP and remembered how fucking slow the AI was in the FGTs. So, uh, yeah, about that. Now I have no idea what my favorite thing in the GT favorite single thing in the GT series is. Probably the GT5 24 hours of Le Mans. To be perfectly honest. Hello, Mr. Q Man. Anyways, got four laps to get around Rossi here. No pressure. Gonna have the pace on him, so you know. If four races, you won by five laps of high speed ring. God damn. Yeah, they're especially slow at HSR. It's kind of ridiculous how slow they are at HSR. And around Rossi, same way I got around Miller. By making him puss out in chicane. Go me. It's a clean pass, I'll take it. It's a clean pass, and I stayed within the track boundaries, therefore... Oh, okay. Speaking of track boundaries, where am I going? That's not correct. Yoink. And we have a massive lead over the rest of the field, because, you know, two class difference. So, hooray. Class racing, kind of. I like all, the, all of the like, other than this thing, of course. All the, uh, I guess, production Seats are D class. Then you have the, um, the Cup car here, which is in B. So, hooray! God damn it! Oh God, K 
boys. If you can win GT5 Nurburg in NASCAR, I will fucking kiss the ground you walk on. Have fun with the night part. Because, you know, NASCAR, no headlights. It's gonna be literally blind. This thing has an interesting looking diffuser. The way that like there's actual like diffuser part going underneath the exhaust tip. It's interesting. Yeah, oh wait, no headlights, yeah, that realization. It's not like GT4, there's actual time transitions. track is always lit, except it's not. Only in the camp sec camping sections, which is actually most of the track, really. Oh, hey, Chris. Meanwhile, I'm way the fuck ahead. How far ahead? Four seconds. All right. Okay, we're going this way. I approached that a little too wide there, but got the victory. A nice solid win. In a series of solid wins in these manufacturers uh, races. Got 4.1 over Rossi. Muller another second back, and then everyone else we wait. Major racer. Hey, they're making it across the line now, sweet. Alright. So, there we go. That was pretty, pretty tame. I'm okay with that. So, let's move on to our second race, shall we, of the Sayat Club. Oh, the Corvette series of Lingenfelter with stock tires. Yeah, um... That was quite the adventure, K-Boys. Doing the fuck- driving the fucking Lingenfelter with stock tires. Yeah. Throttle control is a must. Just- just, uh... Anyways, we're going to Catalonia for a second race. To the National Circuit for three laps. To Barcelona! How was the Rossi pack? Um, seemed pretty good. I am really rusty at a set of courses slash using my wheel, but it was good. I think it's a good pack. I'm not the biggest fan of the Red Bull ring, but it's a nice addition and it's uh, very well mapped. And I don't know. Oh, hey, Thunder is hosting me now. Hooray. Do I have all the 43 DLC? No, I don't. I'm sure there's some DLC like on my main account that I've missed, and this is a completely different account that doesn't even have Xbox Live, so... Yeah. I got a really good- Okay, we're doing the National Circuit, I forgot about that. I was gonna say, I got a really good launch, and then I saw Rossi slam on the brakes. Because I thought we were doing the GP Circuit. Golden Q. I see the uh, NFS 2015 players are very courteous people. Fucking following you just to crash you into a wall. Oh shit. I'm gonna get that acceleration out of the turn. Or not, we can go wide as well. Kind of forgot this is a front wheel drive car, so uh, stabbing the throttle may not provide the best results. Excuse me, Rossi.
der. Once again, I forgot this was the national course. I can think with my brain mate, yes. I'm like, I'm used to the GP circuit. Don't mind me. I guess that guy felt like being an asshole. He's like, hey, look, I'm gonna fuck up this guy's day. It'll be an epic troll. He'll get so angry, and I'll enjoy my miserable existence now. Probably gonna mod my. I don't know. Like, I'm thinking I could mod my three. C yeah. I was thinking for a moment, like, should I mod this one or should I mod a different one? But no. I'm thinking about maybe one day, because I can't do it, having somebody mod my 360 so I can get um, whatever the fuck I want in whatever game I want. This includes, like, you know, unicorn cars and shit. Fuck you, turn 10. If, I've, if I can find a stupid way to get mythical Pokemon, I'll stu find a stupid way to get unicorn cars. They're essentially the same thing. Okay, remember, national course. Need to break early. The turn is right here, and it's a hairpin, not the fucking chicane. Oh god. I mean, I'm gonna have to mod it eventually for the, you know, just the, uh, the whole five-minute drive reboot thing for when I do Forza 2 and beyond. So I'm gonna need all the Dulka cars and Unicorn cars, etc. So, yeah. Console modding. Hooray! When that'll ever happen, I don't fucking know. If it'll ever happen, I don't fucking know. And when? Yeah, I think I had a, uh engine sound glitch there right at the last second. Not sure. So I may or may not have uh, forced caused Rossi to finish third because of my uh, forgetfulness. Whoops. Oh well. Oh well. So there we go. Everyone's crossed the line. Our second race is done. A little bit of... Hey, 427. That's my birthday. For repairs. And we got more uh, upgrade discounts and shit. So, two races down, two races to go. And... We'll be done with this series and stuff. So, to Sakuba we go for our third race. that will be an interesting one. Because Sakuba is always interesting. So, yeah. Get a sip of tea. Because I'm inherently British, apparently. No, I don't know. Don't mind me. I'm gonna get a hat off of eBay. eBay? Eh. I don't know. That doesn't sound like very trustworthy. It sounds like something you should probably tread very carefully about, K-Boys. Because you never know what kind of wear is on the hat. The hat, the hat, the hat. Anyways, let's race the Sakuba. For four laps and stuff. So, hooray. Interesting rims on this car. Oops, whoops, 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 cameras. Okay, there we go. What culture's live streaming the brand split? As in, like, 
they're gonna stream the their reactions to the draft tomorrow. Is that what you're talking about, Thunder? Also, simple race car uh, gauges here. Got digital tech, got the speedometer, got the gears, got the lap, and got the race position. Okay, excuse me. Pardon me more. And my controller disconnected. Okay. I was wondering what I was going to happen during mid race. Like I said, it might be. Yeah, I think my next like investment might be in a new 360 controller. I think uh, something in the wiring is starting to not be happy. I still have a wireless controller for backup, but I'd rather not use it, because, eh. Batteries. Finagling with my Wii is annoying enough, because batteries, but yeah. I don't want a battery. Anyways, shut up, me. Slipstream off Rossi, that fucking shift lag, holy shit, Rossi. How the hell did you get that much shift lag, my my buddy? My man. Kill yourself, my man. Best Viper album? No, no. I'm sure nobody will understand that reference. And dirty pass around Rossi. Gotta hold him off for two laps, which is easy enough. Considering I'm the better driver. Round sweeper. This is an interesting, uh, like, I guess FOV, or no, POV, actually. Because, like, the wheel, the steering wheel and the hands are just so, they're almost out of frame. That's how far down they are to this camera position. It's very interesting. fucking early 2000s Formula 1 game holocaust. It's like, hey, you have F1 2000, Formula 1, and then F1 championship season. It's like, eh, why? Why'd you do this to us game makers? I don't know. Anyways, I won the race. Got the fastest lap. And kicked Rossi's ass by two seconds. Now we'll wait on the uh, other cars, which are now crossing the line 20 seconds behind me, is Evans. And there we go. That just leaves one race remaining in the Sat Club. In the club. Cool. Anti-roll bar discounts. Heck yeah. Is there any way for the chat to appear on YouTube stream? No, because I turned it off. I'm not turning it back on. Formula One Thunder 2000. Yes, that was clearly taken, K-Boys. 
Oh boy, Silverstone for final race. The national circuit. Ooh. Hmm. I guess the national circuit isn't all that bad. I don't know. Still not a fan of Silverstone, so. What's in the Imrazi pack? The red pack for a set of corsets. Uh, a 2013 spec and a 2015 spec Ferrari Formula One car. Uh, Ferrari 488 GT3. Uh, Lamborghini Aventador Super Veloce. A couple vintage Maserati like race cars, and then a couple Maser uh, GT4 Maserati and a fucking Maserati SUV. It's a pretty neat pack, and the Red Bull ring, and the Red Bull ring, but yeah. I liked it. I mentioned the Lamborghini. No. God, yeah, early titles for EA Sports games. NBA Live. Triple play baseball. Madden in if it wait a minute. Yes, a Maserati SUV. You heard me right, K boys. I actually remember we're doing the national circuit here, not the Grand Prix circuit. Go me. I'm learning. That there are shorter versions of tracks. Again, shift lag give me a little run on Muller here. And making the pass very easily. Ooh, that was a nice run out of that last turn. Didn't get any understeer, at least from what I was expecting. I'm not sure what I'm trying here, but Rossi's not going to give me the room. Rossi here by being cool. Suck on that, Rossi. Okay, we're going wide. Holy shit. though. Somehow. Not entirely sure how. I bet these would be fun to race because they're pretty bulky and they're also like, you know, not like per particularly fast, but yeah. I'm sure they could provide some actual good tight bumping and banging racing. Killer Aussie. Well, an angel. I see how you feel. Hey, okay, Kaiju. I just realized you were in the chat. Like, I realized. Like, yeah, shut up, me. Kaiju. Hooray! So you have uh, three distinct groups of cars here. As far as the race, Ying is 
concerned. I see there's new titch emotes, okay. peasy. Got four and a half seconds over Rossi. And now we wait on the other Leons and the Ibizas. Hooray! There we go. Alright, so, Leon, Leon Cup, no, Sayat Cup, done. Sayat Club, excuse me. Sayat Club. And we got another 11,000 credits. Hey, we're up to 700,000. We're getting ever so much closer to being able to do the prototypes here. Fuck off, controller. Anyways, we're getting ever so much closer to being able to finally do the prototype road test, but not quite yet, so. There's the Sayat Club down. Next time on Forza 3, we will tackle the BMW Owners Club, so stay tuned.